So I've been getting asked this question a lot in the comments below about my colorblind settings. So in today's video, we're going to dive in and I'm going to show you how to put these colorblind settings and how they work. And then I'm going to explain to you why I use them and show you how good they can be. So what do you notice right away? Names are green. It's a very big indicator. It's a light green. You can see objectives are green and it's a very light and popping green. Now, you're wondering how did I do this setting? Well, let's dive into that very quickly and get on with the video. If you go to settings and you go to your graphic settings, it is not an interface. I think past Call of Duties, it was interface and colorblind modes have been recently released about a couple years ago. So I've, I believe for announced it's Utopia, but you want to put your color like this dark blue color, ally color, dark, dark blue, enemy color. This is where it's important. You want to put this light green color. Um, anything that really pops, I feel like the light green pops the most and it's like very easy to see. And then for a party color, if you want to have it different, uh, so you know, obviously where your party teammates are in like pubs and stuff, you can do like I did like a teal kind of color. So basically now when you play the game, um, you're going to see once you have the setting applied, you're going to see your teammate. You see how he has like that bright, bright green color instead of like that, like mediumish red color. Obviously red automatically in our brain signals. Um, hey, they're bad guys, but this bright green is just pops out so much We're gonna go and dive into some gameplay and I'm gonna go and elaborate a lot on it and show you why I like it so much now There's various reasons why I love this color and um, uh, This colorblind mode past cods. I've I've tested some colorblind modes and I did use one I remember in another game. I think it was Might have been IW or no, I think it was World War II. But the colorblind modes are very interesting because usually for these modes, you only want to change the interface. You don't want to change much of the actual game. So this is a setting and the colorblind mode that a lot of pro players are starting to use. And not everyone uses them. And you know, you can use the good old, you know, red and blue kind of thing going on. But this color mode just feels so nice and easy to use man so there is various reasons like i said why i like this mode so let's go straight and dive into it first of all the color is very bright it's very easy to see their name and see their health bars without stressing the eye or stressing a one bit like it's just, it's so easy if i shoot at someone and i see like i that guy you know obviously the red is visible as well but the green is just like slightly easier. This guy is twisted, dude. Oh my God. My God, I feel like this guy thinks he's playing a tournament or something. Jesus, dude, relax, brother. On oh, So not only is it easy to see and the names are easier to see on your game, but when you're looking at the mini map, when you look at your radar, you see these bright green dots. You know, it just feels like so much more visible than what it was, was you know? The bright green is just so bright like but yeah seriously guys like it's just everything just like from from the color to the to the name tags you know to the health bars to the to the to the to the, to the in the uav like look someone's about to shoot right now look at that bright green in the radar bro it's just so bright like obviously i'm not saying red is like hard to see i don't want to make it seem like red is like absurdly difficult and whatnot but it, it you can't deny the green is just a little bit easier and a little bit better because it is it is at the end of the day. Gonna hit a streak here. Oh, bang, bang. Kill myself. Yo, I don't know, bro, but this is a real apathy, bro. Like, what the fuck? Real shit. Let's get it, brother. So that has to be one of the biggest things. I don't know things. if those are apathy numbers. That has to be one of the biggest things um, when it comes to that. Um, I pop a three piece like it's nothing, but it's not the road apathy. Um, the visibility, man. The visibility, it's really good. Um, it's it's slightly better without a fact over the red. It's slightly better, right? Um, you can't you can't deny that. Like if you play it, if you use it, if you watch me use it, or you you try it yourself, like you're gonna be like, wow, this is a little bit easier to see. This is a little bit easier in the, in the mini map. Like everything just is a little bit more visible. Is it a big difference? Will it change it? You know, not really. I mean, it just helps very slightly. It's just a very slight like thing but i like it i do now the next reason why i like it and i do enjoy it there's various reasons like i said the next reason will have to be it's refreshing in you and for someone who plays a lot of call of duty and grinds the shit out of call of duty when i see this new green sort of color it's refreshing to me man uh, you know it like it makes me want to play the game in a way it makes it it's just like new to me like when i hop on i see those colors 
I don't feel the same way I always feel. Like, I don't know. It's nice. It's, it makes it. It makes me. It makes it more enjoyable. It makes me more. I just have more fun playing the game. And it's something little as that. I think it's important for you to enjoy the game and to want to play the game because that's when you know when you're grinding, you're gonna play your best. And you're gonna become the best. So every day I get on, I'm like. I'm not, I'm not, I, you know, I always see like for, for years, man, this is like for 10 years, nine years, eight years. Like it's always that red color, that red color, that red color, you know, the enemy color, the red color. And for the first time, like I'm actually using a different color and dude, I stopped shooting this guy every time it has to be host or something, man. Jesus Christ. Okay. But he's not. And you know, it's just, it's refreshing. Like literally it's refreshing in my brain to see a different enemy color. And it, I, I don't know. I like it. I really do. And that is another reason why. And you see, look at that green color. Would I have beaten them if he was red? Honestly, I don't know. But the green, look at the green. I see his health bar. I see everything clearer. I don't know. I just, feels easier to beam. I could be tripping or, you know, it actually could be a thing. I mean, I think those are like the main reasons. It was kind of like three, three main reasons together. Um, those are kind of the reasons why I, like, I actually enjoy it, like genuinely like it. And... To be completely honest, I don't know if this is something like I'm going to stick forever. I mean, I've been using this setting for about two weeks now. So it's been, I've been using it for a while and I've, I like it a lot. And I just don't see myself switching unless there's some crazy thing where it's like, oh, you need to switch this. Like it's a bad idea kind of thing. You know, I think I'm going to stick to it and you should try it too. Trust me. You're going to like it a lot. Hey, it's me. Apathy gets one. Get two, hit a nice beam here, get three. Okay. All right, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. A nice little secret, basically pro player setting that a lot of pros are trying out right now. And um, it's really nice, man. I, I like it a lot. Just being completely honest. Like this is no like trying to like bait you guys in or just being dishonest like you guys know me i'm a very honest person and i've been using this for a while now and i like it a lot i really like it and i'm probably gonna, like i said i'm probably gonna stick with it for a while unless for some, until maybe the next game maybe i'll switch back but i think this game i might just stick with it all the way and it, it just makes the game more enjoyable in a way i don't know i don't know what it is but i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like especially if you used it and you tried it out and you love it okay okay subscribe as well thank you and watch my all my videos just just go watch them now get the popcorn